Now, we are going to look into division. What is division? We need to understand division as sharing, that is equal sharing. We need to understand division is equal distribution, that means everybody must get the same. And then division is grouping. And finally, division is repeated subtraction. So, these four concepts we need to remember. What is division? Division is sharing. When you share among friends, all must get equal. When you group, division is grouping. Each group must have the same number of things or same number of members. Division is equal distribution. You cannot say one group has got three, another four. Equally distributed and then finally division is repeated subtract. We are going to look into all these four concepts in division. Division and then division. This is the symbol for division. All right. So, <clears throat> what is division? That's what we're going to look at first. What is what is division? First, division is grouping. Hmm? First is division is grouping. Now, you are going to look at division as grouping, forming groups. Okay, now, if there are ten children, group them into five or make two groups of five. Okay, let's say if there are ten children, okay, there are ten children. Put them into groups of five. Put them into groups of five. Of fives. That's what we are going to do. So now we said division is grouping. Okay? So now here we have the ten children here. We have the ten children. Now we are going to put them into groups. Groups of five. So, that's what we are going to do. So now, we are going to have two groups. Okay? We are going to put them into groups of five. So we have one group. Let us put them one by one and group them up. How many in each? 
they should be 5. So you have, you have 1, 2, groups of 5, so 2, 3, 4, so one group is ready, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, there are 10 children and there is a group of 5, another group of 5. So the children are put into two groups of fives. Okay, you have one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so you have your ten. What the number? Ten. Put them into groups of five. Divide it. So you are dividing this ten members. Ten children. What is the symbol for division? Yeah. This is the symbol for division. We are dividing the ten children into groups of five. How many groups? Five. So we are dividing each group will have five. So how many groups all together? You just get two groups. You get two groups of five. So division is grouping. Next we are going to look at division is equal distribution. That's the first one. Okay. So this is A. Now B we are going to look at Division is division is equal equal distribution. Division is equal distribution. So everybody must get equal now. There are, hmm? <coughs> there are six apples and divided equally among three children. Okay. There are, if, there are, if there are, Six apples to be distributed to be equally. If there are six apples to be distributed equally between between three girls. So, division is equal distribution and that's what we are going to do. Now, here are the three girls, okay? One, two, and three. So here are the three girls and how many apples do we have? We have six apples to be distributed among them. Six apples. Now we are going to do equal distribution. So we give the first girl one apple and then we give the next girl another apple and we give the next girl another apple. Okay? And we have six apples. So, one, two, three. Again, we give this girl one more apple. And then we give this girl another apple. The third girl, we give another apple. Okay? Now, two 
four, six, all apples are gone. They are distributed the six apples equally. How many apples are there? Six apples to be equally divided between three girls. So we have six apples to be divided, the division sign between three girls. And how much does an each girl get? Each girl get two apples. Each girl get two apples. All right. Now, we are looking at what is division. And we have done two here. Division is grouping. If there are ten children, put them into groups of five. So, we have two groups of fives and that is ten. Now, second is division is equal distribution and we have six apples to be shared equally among three girls and you each one get two apples. We have done two in what is division. Division is grouping. Group should be equal. Division is equal distribution. Alright? Equally distributed. So, there are six apples to be shared equally among three children. There are ten children to be grouped into groups of five and you get two groups. 